One of the easiest ways to modify an MEP system is using grips. If you select a connected object, such as this T-fitting, a number of grips will appear. Any of the four square grips you see are location grips and can be used to move the fitting to a new location. Because MEP has intelligent connections, the connected objects will also move. Let's see how that works. If I click one of these grips, I can begin to move the fitting. As I move my cursor away from the original point, I'll notice that it says move in XY plane fixed MV parts. And in your book you'll see that there are three different move options. This one, which is fixed in the XY plane, there's movable in the XY plane, and also move in UCS XY plane. The one that's currently showing for fixed MV parts means that attached MV parts will not move. In other words, I can move this fitting to the right or to the left, but I can't move it down or up because it would break the connections or have to move the MV parts. If I do want to move the MV parts, I'll select the fitting and I'll press control to change the move option to movable MV parts. Now the attached MV parts will move with the object. If I move it down, my MV parts will also move down. Finally, if I just want to move the T-fitting away from these objects and disconnect all my connections, I'll select it and press control twice to cycle through the options till I get move in UCS XY plane. Now if I move it away, only the fitting moves, breaking all connections.